When I have a number of documents open in Word, I sometimes want to close some of those documents. First of all, I'm in document 1 according to my title bar. If I go to View in the ribbon and click the Switch Windows button, I can switch to document 4. If I wish to close document 4, which I'm now viewing, I'll hit the red X in the top right corner, and this will close this window. And document 4 is closed. If there are any unsaved changes, I would have been warned to save those changes when I tried to close the file. But because there was nothing in that file, it simply closed it without warning me. If I wish to close document 3, I might choose document 3 at the bottom of my screen. My title bar tells me I'm looking at document 3. This time I might use a key combination to close the window. Control W is used to close a window. So I'll hold the control key and press W. And I've just closed document 3, leaving me with two documents open. If I then switch to document 2, I could press control W and close that window also. I'm left with one document. I don't want to hit the red cross in the top right corner because that'll close me completely out of Word. I want to stay in Word, but I want to close this document. And that's where Control w is very useful. If I press Control w it closes the document but keeps me in Word. If I wish to open up a new document, I could hit this button here on my Quick Access Toolbar or press the key combination Control n So I'll press Control n Control n gives me a new document, document 5, and Control w is the shortcut key to close a file.